All of my youngins is losing their life because they don't know what's life that is outside the trap. People be telling us if we. What's up, everybody? Josh here, back with another video today. I'm gonna do a really quick scooter check for you guys. It's gonna be a super fast video, but I figured if I wanna film a video today, I can film one or two shorter videos like this one. So, yeah. Also, if you guys want a parts graveyard type video, I have a ton of parts like this, way more than just this and this. I have a ton of parts. I could do a few episodes of like a parts graveyard explaining my old parts and stuff, but I'm gonna run downstairs in my garage. I'm gonna show you guys my scooter real quick. I gotta grab my keys. And it's raining, so I gotta rush out there real quick, grab my scooter, and run back. My eyes look so bright in the slide. Okay, before we get in the video, if you're new here and you haven't seen my other videos, you'll probably really enjoy them. The video I uploaded yesterday is me reacting to my old edits. That was super, super good and actually really funny. Um, but yeah, if you guys are new here, go check out my other videos. You really like them. But yeah, we're gonna get into the scooter check now. Here's my beautiful scooter. I love this color. That's like my favorite color on the entire earth. So I'm gonna put my camera on this table. Not that anybody cares where I put my camera. Finally, okay, let me just show you guys my scooter. All right, hopefully this is a good angle. So, starting off on the top, I have some basic pink ODI bar end. Uh, I got them from Dialed, my sponsor. If you guys don't follow my sponsor yet, go follow them at Dialed Scooters and BMX with underscore. I'll put it right here. They'll also put the link in the description. But yeah, so I got nice pink bar ends. I don't know why I like pink bar ends. Uh, I think Lewis gave me the idea and Sam also gave me the idea. But it's sick because it just stands out and makes your bar spins look cool. Uh, but yeah. And then after that, we have some Wilson tennis grip. It's super worn down. So you can say it's super worn down. But basically my friend Sam, he introduced me to tennis grip and it's actually really really good especially for the summertime because uh, I get really really sweaty and so my grips you know it's really hard to it's really hard to keep my hands on the grips that's why I ride tennis grips they're really really comfortable I definitely recommend trying them you can just get a pack of like six on uh, Amazon and usually you just need like three rolls on each side but yeah so these are tennis grips they're black you can get really any color you want but I get black because the color wears down really fast and then right here Sam also showed me this this is hockey tape you can get it at like Dick's Sporting Goods or anything else really and it's better than the tape they give you uh, and you just wrap it up then you're good to go and you can make them as long as you want as short as you want now we have one of my favorite parts of the scooter which is my dialed titanium bar so dialed my sponsor dialed scooters and BMX they have a brand called Inferno that they're gonna start making parts for they've got forks and bars right now uh, grips and a few other things that we're working on stay tuned because we have a lot of things planned with Inferno and dialed you guys are not ready for this stuff but anyway so these bars are uh, obviously raw titanium bars I have them 24 wide by 25 tall with a slit because I'm riding HIC. And my favorite thing about these bars is that not only is there a logo up here, which is super, super sick, it's like a dragon basically. That's the main logo of the bar. But then we have Inferno running down the stem of the bar. So it's super sick because you don't see a lot of tie bars that have a, a logo going down the entire bar. I really, really like them. And if you guys want to get a pair, you can head over to Dialed Scooters and BMX. Uh, it's over in St. Charles, Missouri, if you're anywhere close. But if, you, if you're not close, there's going to be a website coming up soon. And and you can just DM them and figure out if you can get it or not. Okay, now we have the clamp. So the clamp, I've had this clamp for uh, probably about a year now. It's an NV, just a basic NV double clamp, which matches my deck, which I'll get into in a second. I really like this clamp. It's held up for me for a really, really long time. Uh, and it's a six mil Allen key, which is also really good. At the moment, I'm not really running a headset cap. I did have a, uh, I did have an NV headset cap that matched the clamp and which would have looked really, really sick, but I took it off, I don't remember why. I think it was rubbing on my headset. All right, now, one of my other favorite parts. I have a lot of favorite parts about this scooter, but we've got my Dialed or Inferno for super, super sick looking, and the cr the color is black chrome. So not a lot of forks you see are black chrome. Not a lot of parts in general are, have black chrome as a colorway, but they also have gold and normal chrome, but black chrome's my favorite. It looks super, super sick. It has a nice little notch for the bolt so that you don't have to get a uh, plier or anything else so you can just tighten it with one Allen key. All right, and then we have the wheels. So I just put these wheels on. These are Root Industries Honeycore wheels. I'm not gonna be riding them for long, but my friend Aiden, shout out to Aiden. Go follow his Instagram, I'll put it on the screen. He gave me these for free because I had bought some Hang 5 gear wheels in Arizona, and they kind of got messed up really fast. They're already kind of dehubbing, and the bearings are really, really bad. Not hating on Hang 5, but it's probably just the batch of wheels I got. These are really, really nice wheels, super light, and uh, I'm enjoying riding them. But yeah, I'll have some new wheels soon, probably. All right, before we get into the deck, here's my grip tape. It came stock on the deck. It's just a lucky grip tape. Super, super coarse grip tape. So if you like coarse grip tape, get some lucky grip tape. And then finally, oh, I forgot. I forgot my headset. I don't know what headset it is. Just some headset bearings. I couldn't tell you. So now we've got this beautiful lucky prospect, 2021 lucky prospect deck in the 
teal and black colorway. It's super sick. My friend Sam has the teal and yellow uh, colorway. It looks so amazing. But yeah, I definitely recommend this deck. It's 4.8 wide by 19.5 long. You've got the cutouts in the back are kind of like rounded. So you have a lot of space back here for grind. And this is the bottom. Super sick, super shiny. I love this deck. It's so amazing. And uh, yeah, so that's my scooter. Thank you guys for watching this scooter check. Obviously today I'm not going to be getting any clips because it is wet outside. So I'm not going to go anywhere. I'm going to try to film a video or two, get them out to you guys. So the day you're watching this is most likely... The day that this is uploaded is most likely uh, the day that I filmed it, Saturday. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit the like button. It really helps out a lot. And give me some video ideas in the comments if I should do parts, graveyard, or reacting to my other edits, something like that. So yeah, really, really quick, fun video I just filmed. Thank you guys for all the support. And if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. I'll see you guys next time.